Have you ever wondered if graffiti was art or not? Hi, my name is Rosie and I'll be talking about graffiti. I chose this topic because it was a recent interest of mine and I wanted to learn more about it. So, what is graffiti? Graffiti is a form of visual communication, illegal when done on a property without permission. Graffiti includes writings and drawings done on walls or other surfaces. The word graffiti is based off the Italian word graffito, which means engraving. Now I'm going to show you different pieces of art and you can tell me if you think it's art or not. Raise your hand if you think this is art. How about this? What about this? This is Banksy's piece called Girl with a Balloon. Banksy is an anonymous English street artist. His work contains dark humor and political social commentary. Girl with a Balloon is believed to represent love, hope, innocence, childhood, and self-confidence. Next to the little girl, the words there is always hope are engraved. How is art defined? Art is impossible to define, but this is the definition my research let me do. Art is a product made by an artist to share an idea, feeling, or a world view. Art is designed to connect with our emotions. W.K. Wimsout and Monroe Beardsley believe that proofs that art is art should be in the piece of art. On the other hand, contemporary designer Noel Carroll believes that an artist's intentions are relevant to the audience. Art is a product made by someone with a communicative or an aesthetic purpose. This means that an artist paints art to show beauty or communicate a message. Art also has lines, colors, and has texture. How do laws against graffiti affect what people think of graffiti? Laws against graffiti make people think it's horrible and evil because it's considered a crime. Laws also don't let graffiti be in its purest form. When graffiti is done on prop property without permission, it is vandalism. Vandalism is a crime. Therefore, most people are against graffiti. If the law considers graffiti and vandalism, can it still be art? It can still be art because it still has lines, colors, and texture, just like every other art. And it shares feelings and ideas, just like every other art. So it can still be art, even though it's considered vandalism when done on a property without permission. Because it has all the things other forms of art have. Why do graffiti artists paint graffiti? The main reason they paint graffiti is to share their voices. Graffiti artists need somewhere to let out all their feelings. Um, uh, graffiti artists also share their personality through their tag. A tag is a graffiti artist's signature. It is personalized for the graffiti artist. It is a nickname the graffiti artist wants to be known by on the streets or a name they want their work to be known by because that's what they sign it with. In all, graffiti artists show who they are through their art. What are the positive and negative aspects of graffiti? Graffiti is bad and good in many ways. Some of the positive aspects of graffiti is that graffiti can show important ideas and share messages. Awesome graffiti can attract people from all around the world to view it. it um, graffiti artists use it to express themselves. It can be beautiful art, and public art can become a tool to social emancipation or an achievement to a, a political goal. This means that public art can be used to obtain a political or a world goal. This is an example of positive graffiti. Graffiti also has negative aspects. Some of the negative aspects of graffiti is that graffiti can destroy an area some people don't like how graffiti looks, so they have to pay money to get it removed. It's described as crime and blight. It can be used in an offensive way to show discrimination. And spray paint has volatile gases that are released when graffiti is painted onto the surface, which could hurt the environment. This is an example for horrible graffiti. This happened after President Trump won the elections. This is some graffiti I made at home. The styles that I drew are hollow, throw up, straight letter, an example of a tag, and a style that I just drew. I had lots of fun making this because I got to make my own graffiti. By the way, all this graffiti is done with markers, not with paint. So is graffiti art. Graf graffiti has lines, colors, and texture, just like every other art. And it also shares feelings and ideas, just like every other art does. And graffiti artists express themselves through their art, just like every other artist. So do you think graffiti is art? I personally do. Raise your hand if you think graffiti is art. Raise your hand if you think graffiti isn't art. Thank you for listening to my capstone, and I hope you enjoyed. If you want to learn more about my capstone experience, you can visit my blog. You can scan this QR code, and you can visit, or you can visit this link. Thank you, and remember, graffiti is art.